Hey y'all, what's up? It's your girl Reese and welcome back to another one of my videos. Also, if this is your first time here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and also turn on your post notifications so that way when I upload my next video, you will be the first to know. Okay, so I am back with another reading for you guys. Um, this is going to be a spiritual love Jones general energy reading so please keep in mind that this is a collective reading this could resonate with anybody out there or it may not resonate with you you know just take what does and if it don't leave that shit where it's at also keep in mind i do curse um <laughs> and stuff like that and i keep it real over here so i'm just letting y'all know ahead of time before we get started okay um also i do have um a second channel where i will be doing like more readings and stuff like that over there so make sure you guys check out the description box down below and yeah we're just gonna go ahead and jump right in and we're gonna see what spirit got for you guys um i hope you guys are having a blessed sunday today um i've been having a relaxing sunday i just finished cooking me some salmon girl and some um green beans and some rice so i'm really excited about eating that when i get done um and, you know, just enjoy my day. So I hope you guys are doing the same thing, getting some self-care in and stuff like that. Um, but, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and jump right in and see what spirit, a.k.a. God, got for you today. All right, so the first thing just flipped over is don't be afraid. So, hmm. Um, I feel like with that card popping out, what I'm picking up on right now is something... Um. Is going to be coming in for you. Um, something's going to be coming in. Bad playing games just popped out too. Let's see. Spirit, give me some messages. Dang. Cars just flying out, honey. Okay. I'm not going to pick these up off the ground. We're going to see what else Spirit give us. Spirit, give me some messages for my beautiful soul trap. Because I ain't even got a chance to shuffle the damn cards, yeah, bitch. And cards is already fucking popping out. <clears throat> so, let's see what we get. It's too many. Let's see what we get. Also, like I told y'all, keep in mind, I am not a tarot reader, okay? I literally get downloads from Spirit and um, like a God, basically. And um, I wrote these down on my own, on my own cards, because I picked up on these messages. Um, I don't do like personal readings and stuff like that. But um, yeah, this is, you know, I just wanted to clarify that because I know a lot of people, you know, y'all ain't seen this side of me over here. All right, so we got Hustle. All right, so let me see what else we get before I start picking up on this energy. God is with you. All right, what is this? Who cares? Oh no, this is too many. <laughs> this is a whole little spot popped over. But I also feel like, okay, so so far, let me go ahead and so far, I feel like this is just you right here. All of this energy is you. I feel like you've been really like um, working really, really hard on whatever it is you've been working on. Um, it's like you, you're you done playing games with people. Like you're just, you've been cutting a lot of people off. Um, yeah, you've been cutting a lot of people off because you just really been focused on yourself. You've been working hard, you've been hustling, you've been grinding. I feel like you just been, you know, focused on yourself and with this don't be afraid card coming out and God is with you. I feel like that's why you should not be afraid. I always know God is with you. No matter what you're going through, um, God is with you. Like you're going to get through, you're going to get through this and your hard work, I feel like is getting ready to pay off. This card wants to pop out because it's the one that fell on the floor a while ago. Catch a vibe. Um... So it might be time for you to get out and have some fun or somebody wants to spend some time with you. So we're going to see on that one. But yeah, maybe you should just relax a little bit more too. 
That's also what I'm picking up on for somebody. That could be for somebody specifically. Don't be like so in your head about um, things happening like right now. Because whatever you want is going to happen. Like this book right here, um, this is like my journal, but um, on the front it says, with God, all things are possible. Matthew, brr, it's, it's scratched out, but it's not faded away. But with God, all things are possible. God is with you. Don't be afraid. You know what I'm saying? Just relax a little bit. Like I said, today is Sunday. Girl, you should be probably getting some self-care in. If you're not already, I know I need to go get my nails and stuff done. I just really don't feel like going to the nail salon today. But stuff like that, you know, anything that really makes you happy, even if it's just turning on a movie and just relaxing, like, catch a vibe, chill out. <laughs> All right. See, look at this. Good vibes only. I told y'all. <laughs> chill out. Like, relax. Good vibes only, like, I'm telling you, you have a lot of good energy surrounding you. God is with you, so that definitely means you are protected. So you don't have a reason to be afraid of what's getting ready to happen. Like, don't stress out. Just let it flow. You know what I'm saying? Like, let your blessings flow in. Because your hard work is getting ready to pay off. All right, spirit. What else do you have for my beautiful... Divine Feminines. What else do you have for my beautiful Divine Feminines? All right. So, look, patience. So, you got to have patience. Y'all know that saying when they say God may not come when you want him to, but he'll be there right on time. He's coming. He may not have come, like like I was saying, you may have been wanting stuff to happen like right now. I, you remember I was saying that earlier. But you gotta have some patience, sweetie, okay? You gotta have some patience, relax, you know what I'm saying? Catch a vibe and just, you know what I mean? God is with you, so you don't have a reason to be stressing out, worrying, being afraid of what's to come. Let's see, what's this? Look, I want to take you out. All right? I want to take you out. Just popped out. So, this, when this card popped out, this definitely means, I don't know, somebody probably got their eyes on you. Somebody probably got their eyes on you, sweetie. Why you been over here hustling and working hard? I don't know, this could be a secret admirer. It could be somebody you're dealing with currently. You know, take what resonates. Um, but we definitely don't see what pops out. See, uh, this just popped out on the um, flip side, healing. So you've been doing a lot of healing. Like I said, whoever, um, I feel like, Somebody been watching you while you've been going through your um, healing journey. I'm trying to get this card. Somebody been watching you while you've been going through your healing journey and just been hustling in your bag, focus. So, so I feel like somebody wants to date you. I don't know. Like I said, this could be old love, new love. It could be your ex. Um, I don't know. What is this? Flame, I'm on the way. Okay, so <laughs> um, this could be somebody that stays at a distance from you. But even if they don't stay at a distance from you, um, you know, this is somebody you're definitely not like living with or anything like that. So if you're living with somebody or whatever like that, this is this is not your reading. <laughs> but um this could be somebody, like I said, that's at a distance from you, even if they're not playing distance away. They could be like across town or, you know what I'm saying, something like that. Or just not right there with you at this moment. Not Y'all not living together and stuff like that. But they're coming in, basically. That's why I was saying with this card coming out, that I want to take you card. I mean, take I want to take you out card coming out. Um, and then this coming out, I'm on the way. Um, 
they're definitely coming in, bro. Like, and this is quick. With this plane at the top, that means they're coming in fast. Really fast. They really are, I feel like they, I don't know. I feel like whoever this person is, like they're turned on by your hustle. Like whatever you do for a living, they're turned on by that. Look, in my feelings. So you got this person in, <clears throat> in their feelings thinking about you. They did not want me to tell you that. <laughs> so they probably haven't told you this. That's why I say I feel like this could be somebody, I don't know. Like, even if it's not a secret admirer, it's somebody that has like that secret admirer energy. Like they just been keeping their eyes on you. This could be new love. This could be an ex that you were dealing with before, but somebody is definitely coming in and somebody is definitely um, in their feelings about you. All right, Spirit, so what other messages do you have? I'm gonna take this one, I don't know what this is, but I'm gonna take it. Speak the name. All right, so I'm better here. Sometimes when this card pops out for me, um, personally, um, it's more so like when you need to speak up and call on God, but I also feel like just in this particular instance, um, this person needs to speak up. If they like you and they want you, they need to speak up. And I feel like that's why they're coming in. Like, you probably, like I said, you probably don't even know how this person really feels. But um, look at this. It's a new love. <laughs> this is a new love coming in. Whoever this person is. Whoever this person is, it's definitely a new love. Like I said, this I was getting secret admirer energy. Like, and even, like, okay, even if it's not, like, for some people, it's a secret admirer. But for some of y'all, like, it's your ex coming in with, like, this new love energy, like, this flirtatious energy, like, oh, I want to start over type shit. Like, <laughs> that's what it's coming in as. And that's because they see you moving forward in your life. They see you healing. They see you hustling and stuff like that and they see you moving forward in your life and that's why they want to come in with like this oh i miss you type energy and stuff like that so that's what i'm picking up on for some of y'all and for some of you like i said it's definitely a secret admirer you got somebody new coming in so if you're not dealing with nobody at all like i said and you've been wondering like when am i gonna meet somebody girl they on the way just be open to it. All you got to do is relax. Like I was saying, catch a vibe. Like, just relax and let God bring you a good-ass man. Like, <laughs> let God bring you somebody good that really want to, like, you know, take you out and stuff like that. I feel like, shoot, us as women, you know what I'm saying? We should be getting taken out on a, on a regular basis. <laughs> shoot, take me out. Yeah, I want to go out to eat. Look, it's your winning season. That's why I said you've been healing. You've been hustling. Don't be afraid of what's getting ready to happen because it's going to be good. It's going to be good, whatever is happening. And look at this. I told y'all this person was thinking of you. In my feelings, when, when this card popped out, I told y'all this person is definitely thinking of you. <laughs> so like I said, whoever you're thinking about, or like I said, if you don't have no body, Somebody been keeping their eye on you. And they have not been telling you that they've been thinking about you. They coming in. They about to speak up. They about to like be like, you know what? Let me go ahead and holler at y'all. Because I've been watching her and I just really like what I see. And like I said, if this is an ex, they like, let me go ahead and get my baby back. Because she going to get away. Somebody going to snatch your ass up if, your, um, if he don't get it together. That's too many cards. But yeah, he coming in. It's your winning season. Like I said, don't be afraid of whatever is getting ready to happen. God is with you. 
you might be clueless. Like, you probably like, <laughs> what's going on in my life? Like, I'm just working hard. I've been trying to heal. Like, what's going on? Don't worry about it. All right, Spirit, we're going to get one more card. One more card. Let me see one more card for y'all. Okay, what is this? Feeling unappreciated. So for some of you, this is definitely your ex. Because this is how they had you feeling before. Like before you started your whole healing process and all of that, this person had you feeling unappreciated. Okay, and like I said, now they see you moving forward. You've been healing. You've been hustling. You've been in your bag. You've probably also been growing your relationship with God too. And now they want to come back in. They've been thinking about you a lot. Okay, so the choice is definitely yours. You know what I'm saying? When it comes down to this person coming back into your life. But just keep in mind, you still like going through your journey. Do not mess this up for this person if they're not putting in the actions to go along with those words. You know what I mean? Um, also, um, for some of you, like I said, this is definitely a new love coming in. So get ready because whoever this person is, they really been like keeping their eyes on you. This could be somebody watching you on social media. This could be somebody at your job um, or whatever, but they about to start you know, making their way towards you because they like what they see. Okay, so like I said, this was a general um, spiritual love Jones reading. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, if it resonated, make sure you guys comment down below, like this video, and I will see you guys in my next one. God bless.